Good afternoon, all. We have uh, Beatrice O'Carry here with us today. Thank you, Beatrice, for coming. You're you having a very, very good season, in fact. Uh, twi won twice in the LPGA Tour, uh, number six, I think, on the money list. Uh, what's it like to be here in St Andrews? It's great to be back, and uh, it's great to be back after six years and see how much I've I've come along and my progression and. Um, you know, I'm, I'm really enjoying the season. Uh, I had a great season last year, but I knew that I was probably, I had to improve my short game, and uh, I did that over the winter, and uh, obviously it's paying off, and, um, you know, two wins, um, that's that's great, and I hope that, you know, I can get my first major soon. Your, your first uh, major championship uh, over here was 2007. Did that come as a bit of a culture shock to you, playing Lynx golf? Yes, a little bit, although I grew up playing uh, some tournaments as an amateur on links courses. Uh, it was definitely a big change uh, with the setup, you know, it was a major event, a uh, big, big tournament, the biggest I had played up until then, and it was a little bit of a shock and everything was new, definitely, and the conditions were, were I remember it was really windy, and, um, you know, obviously the, the course was playing as a major golf course, so um, I remember it uh, as a great excitement and a great experience, and I'm just really happy to come back and and really, you know, um, with the experience that I've learned and I've uh, gained over the years to, you know, improve my yeah. my result over here. And how, how much golf had you played in the UK before that, or was that literally the first time? No, I mean, I always spend my summers, um, as an amateur, I always spend my summers playing over here, playing the British girls, the British yeah. stroke play, uh, European championships, and um, I remember I somehow I spent the entire summer uh, over here. So, yeah, just trying to learn and okay. improve my game. We'll open it out to questions. Beatrice, I think the last time I spoke to you, you were learning Japanese. Are you still doing yes. that? And yes, I am. Can you give yourself a handicap in Japanese? What would <laughs> thirty-five? <laughs> <laughs> no, uh, I mean, I'm, my Japanese is really basic, and the thing is, I I study a lot uh, during the winter in December when I have time off, and then I really try to have as many lessons as I can. Uh, but you know, it's just a completely different language. I have to start from scratch. There is nothing I can really resemble to any other language that I speak, and I have to learn three different alphabets. So um, you know, is is I knew it was going to be a challenge, and I knew I had to put a lot of time into it uh, during the season. You know, is I always get caught up with different things, and you know, probably I get lazy and I don't want to study. Uh, but I still I'm. I'm still focused on that. I still want to learn and improve, and I think it's such a great culture, and the people are so welcoming that you know I think I really want to hopefully speak it fluently uh, at some point. So um, I'm still on it. It's a project, but you know, I'm, like I said, I have to really be a little bit more disciplined and, and study a little bit more during the year. Uh, uh, most people have been asked about who might win here and, and Imbi's uh, progression to the potential fourth major. Um, is that good for the women's game or is that uh, detrimental? I think it's great for women's game. I really think so. I mean, I think she's proved an amazing level of, of golf consistent and obviously uh, handling pressure uh, week after week in majors. Um, I can't imagine how much pressure she must have felt, not only worldwide, but in her own country. And I think it's great because this is really where we're going. You know, this is a global tour and this is, th we are the best tour in the world. And we're f based on many different nationalities. and. Nobody has ever achieved that. You know, you always see it. I, I love watching tennis, and you always see it, like, you know, one year Nadal is dominating, one year Djokovic is dominating, and you, have, you don't see it because golf, it takes a lot more. There's, it's just so many other different factors that have to play in, you know, different courses, different setup, and, you know, some courses playing longer, some courses playing shorter, so it benefits some, more, some players more than others. And she's won three out of three. I mean, I think that's amazing. And I think that's great for us. And it's definitely drawing attention to us, which, you know, we deserve. So in terms of the projection of the women's game, per se, it's a, it's a huge benefit. I definitely think so. 
I definitely think so. I mean, I, I understand some journalists want certain nationalities to win, but this is where we're going. It, it, we are global, and uh, is the best player no matter where she comes from. <laughs>